When Alex was 14, people started to show an interest. Alex liked it, it was something new. Soon, some people started to ask Alex to share naked pictures with them. They said that everyone was doing it, that they wouldn't tell anyone. It's between me and you. They said, don't be boring, don't be a prude. So Alex decided to send the pictures. They sent the pictures around to other people. And once they had the pictures, the people stopped talking to Alex. Alex felt alone, ashamed, used, stupid. For a long time, Alex thought sex was about giving something away. This has changed. Recently, Alex had a threesome with two friends. Alex felt liberated, sexy and playful. It was one of the most pleasurable experiences Alex had ever had and Alex's perception of sex was transformed. Just like Alex, we all have our secrets, lived events of intimate encounters. They pleasure us, confuse us or trap us inside our own bodies. They fill our minds, our memories and our fantasies or fiddle with our guilt, our shame and our pain. It's time that we join in with the efforts of university initiatives such as the Safer Sussex campaign to create a safe, responsible and respectful community. Let's suss out sex at Sussex University. Let's talk openly about diverse and everyday experiences of sex. Storytelling is a powerful tool to break the silence around sex, pleasure and sexuality. This is why we propose to organise a series of storytelling workshops. In these spaces, we will work with students from different backgrounds to enable them to transform their stories through creative outlets, such as theatre, visual arts, music, poetry, dance, anything they want. These will be showcased in exhibitions and live performances on and off campus, in local festivals such as Brighton Fringe, we want to create an interactive space where people can engage with these stories and immerse themselves in multiple perspectives of sexual experiences. From this, we can design an open source online multimedia platform that can serve as an educational resource for other learning communities. Under an appointed coordinator of the Sussing Out Sex programme, we will collaborate with a strong network of staff and alumni, as well as external organisations. Don't suffer alone. Our stories are not to be buried. They are waiting to be told. If you want to join our movement and break the silence, like this video and share it with your networks. Let's suss out sex together.